Hey there and welcome back to our channel. So tell me, do you want to create unique and to the point offers and proposals for clients with just a couple of clicks and within minutes? Well, that's what Notch brings to the table. Notch is the first platform for proposal building that feels like Notion, but specifically for customer facing proposals. So if you're ready to explore it, let's just dive right into it. Notch is a modern proposal and documents builder tailored to small sales teams and agencies. And it makes the process of creating these proposals and offers very interactive and attractive and easy to share with your clients. So you do not have to send a bunch of emails. You just need this one document from Notch. And if you go a little bit down on their landing page, you can see uh, who is not specifically for. So it's for sales managers, it's for head of sales, it's for account executives. Uh, if you go a little bit down more, you can see what you can do with Notch. So you can create fully customizable spaces and you have pre-made templates for this for different purposes. Then you can select from more than 20 interactive elements. We'll get back to this. And then you can consolidate all your sales resources. Okay, so now we know this. Let's try them out in action. So right now I'm on my Notch dashboard and let's see what it has to offer. So first things first, we have this overview section here, which is basically a glimpse into how we're performing, what, um, I don't know, deadlines are coming up, what tasks we need to concentrate on, which reports are still in progress that we need to work on, etc, etc. Here in this uh, section, you can see the recently created uh, spaces. You can see the space titles, their stages, either they are active or archived. Then you can see the activity. Is this deal still going on or is it closed? And then you can see the close date, which is basically the deadline. Okay, so now let's move on to spaces, which is basically the gist of Notch. And to really understand what it does, I recommend creating our own space together. Once you click on this add space button, you can see two options. Either start with a blank space or select a template. Let's first uh, stick to the select a template option. And here we've got four pre-made templates, which means four different cases, four different offers, let's say, and purposes. Okay, so here we have sales proposal, then we have offer signature, we have digital sales room, and we have onboarding space. And these differ in their structure. So for example, this onboarding space is completely different from what we have in this sales proposal. These are very nicely constructed uh, templates that you can use, which guarantees fine results. Okay, so let's proceed with this sales proposal one. Let's select a template and let's name it. So let's say I want to um, send a proposal to Apple. Uh, and then again, uh, here I can enable this client branding, you see? And once I type Apple here and choose the website and create the space, you can see that our space is already Apple branded. Nice. And here now we will need to make our uh, configurations we need to choose our recipient's name and we make these very personalized offers, uh, which is very enticing actually. Okay, here we have the executive summary, we have the recommended approach, success factors, we have our clients going on here and that's awesome, that's really nice. And you can of course do your own customizations here. You can either add anything from here that we have or you can simply click on this and delete it or duplicate it. Okay, so now that we have um, seen how it works once we choose from a template, let's see how it works if we try to start from scratch. So again, let's head to spaces and from here add space and start with a blank space. Let's again name it. Uh, let's name it this time Samsung. Okay, create a space. Mm -hmm. uh, so from here, uh, once you click on this, the slash will appear here and you have different categories to choose from. These are our interactive elements. Uh, so from the text, you can choose heading one, heading two, paragraph, bullet list, ordered list, uh, and mention. Then we have the uh, proposal part, the important part, the key part, the welcome element, the summary, value proposition, team overview, contact card, client logos, 
frequently asked questions and call to action. So let's just build something from here. Let's say this is our intro. Then we will have the uh, paragraph here. Um, okay, then let's move on and add something else. Let's add the welcome element. Mm -hmm. Here you can see this is our page. You can see the email and again, you are free to do the customizations here. So you basically got the idea. It's very similar and very um, easy to what we have in Notion, right? Um, okay, again, let's see. And we can also do the call to action. We, have, we can have a button here. Uh, again, customize this text here. So this is really awesome. Now, I want to show you how well planned this Notch platform is. So at the end of your proposals and offers and messages that you send to your clients, you usually have the CTA, right? The call to action, maybe in form of contact us or message us. So in this case, it's message. Uh, and here, if you edit, you can choose the person, the uh, assignee that your client uh, can contact. So from here, let's choose this one. And once your client clicks on this message button or whatever button you put, they will appear in this conversation like box. So once they type their questions here, let's say, um, hello, I'm interested. And send, you can go to messages and you will find it right in this Apple and the space specific conversation box. So we have a different conversation box for each of these uh, spaces that we have created, which is really awesome, which is very cool, especially for not confusing um, the offers that we have sent to this uh, specific clients. Awesome. I'm really impressed with this feature. And from here, your assignee can answer. Uh, besides this, we have also this task section here where you can assign tasks with these spaces as well. So for example, let's say in this demo one, we have this three tasks. You can choose the due dates for them. You can choose the assignee from here. Let's say like this. And then from here, once it's done, you can just check this and it will mark as crossed. So this is really awesome for team collaboration and for outside collaboration. So besides uh, successfully collaborating with your clients and sending them messages and receiving these uh, messages in these different spaces, you also have the ability to communicate within your team and ensure the smooth collaboration. I'm really amazed, uh, but that's not all as well. We have this uh, content library here as well, uh, which is uh, for gathering all your uh, important assets, let's say, or the files or the, um, I don't know, photos maybe, or the logos that you use, uh, the brand logos that, for example, are your collaborators. Uh, you can put them here and constantly use them and reuse them. So that's pretty much it. Last but not least, let's also talk about the pricing, which is very important before making any kind of decision. And here in not just case, we can see that the pricing structure is very flexible and it keeps businesses of different sizes and needs in mind. So here, first of all, we have the uh, forever free plan, uh, which I was, by the way, using and you could see how generous the free plan itself was. Uh, so it included up to five spaces, it included the templates and the magic link. But if you want to go beyond these limits and experience more, then you can try out one of the paid plans. So here we have start plan. Um, you can, by the way, use the 14-day um, free trial to get the idea of how it will benefit you. Uh, and it includes everything in a free plan plus unlimited spaces the content gallery available, and the signature element, which gives more credibility. This is uh, particularly suitable for small sales teams. Then we have the growth plan, which is for larger sales teams. And here it includes, again, everything in the start plan, plus buyer analytics for making more informed decisions, you know. Then you also have HubSpot integration, Slack integration, and founder support. Awesome. And then they have also this scale plan. Uh, and to know the pricing, um, you better book a call uh, with them also to see the demo and understand how it will benefit you. Uh, but in any case, it includes all in the growth plan plus custom domain, 
white label design and Salesforce integration and SSO. This is really awesome. Uh, by the way, you will save 30% uh, for the start plan if you're using annually and 20% uh, for the growth plan. So keep that in mind. Well, that's it about Notch, the tool that will help you better manage your client proposals and customer facing documents. And if you've still got any questions concerning it, don't forget to drop them in the comments and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. And if you like this video, then don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell to not miss out any of our upcoming videos. And I'll see you next time and have a nice day. Bye bye.